seriously. might have to switch these two. This is not hurting animals. Not not petting a cow. You I hate this little clumps of hat. Uh, little flaps. Mm. And I rinse this off. Set my tongue. Huh? All right. Meat tenderizer. La 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 la. La 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 la. La 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 la. All right. Regular salt. Minced onion. I don't like the onion. But I do use the hot of these. This is dash. A bit of seasoning salt. Yeah, 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 yeah. This would be mac and cheese for mac and cheese. Distracted by the floor, so let's see what we got here. Yeah, this one for that vegan teacher. I don't know if I've already said that or not. Oh, yeah, I think I just hit the phone. I'll lick it off now later. <laughs> That bone's gonna fall off. I'm gonna take it away. Dash. I love it. I don't use pepper and junk because I figure there's Mrs. There's pepper in the Mrs. Dash. I don't use pepper. Oh, <laughs> I accidentally got them in the boiling water. I'm getting ready to douse it down. Whoops. Uh, yeah. Usually I'll just use the Montreal on the one side because I don't like to take the flavor away from the steak. You know, because that, that stuff will make it spicy. Yeah, there, there's pepper in that too. But I really, I won't hardly ever use that stuff. Mm. 
Uh huh. Oh yeah. Oh. oh Yeah. Work it, work it, mm-hmm, work it, work it, yeah, make love to the camera, uh-huh, 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 and, and, and it's not, not hurting me anymore, this is nothing to do with how you treat Animals. I'm hurting myself, maybe. <laughs> I'm just going. Where to go? Yeah. Oh. And, and when you got that added love, that's what he and, and, and the ingredient of love. That's what it is. Tending to it. That guy on that, uh, you guys move it. Turn, don't burn. And this one looks good. And that's how we like our steaks. Okay, this one, I show, uh, I know. Let's get it back. And we'll shut it up. Then. That one cage is steak. Wait, I just flip this one. And this one. So I think I might have just flip this one too. Oh no, you turn that one off. Alright. The cloud. It is nice. No, I shut it off and it's still cooking. Copper cookware. Hmm. Yeah, this one is totally done. And get the mac and cheese mixed together. Get the water out of it. I'm going to straighten it back out, flatten it. And take this handle. And they go like this. Get it all to the corner. Oh, oh, shit, it's on the counter. And then, uh, take this and I fold it in half. Like this. And these two fingers, like this. And I slide them right down it. And hit that every last little bit. It works when I have both my hands, but right now I do not. <laughs> or no. And that's really all you guys do. You squirt that in, you stir it up, add some salt, good to go. Or you could, you could do like I do, I got another video for it, something I call hillbilly slop. And it's mac and cheese mixed with peas and ground beef. It's actually really good. We use two packs of this cheese for that stuff. Because the cheese and the meat need extra, or the peas and the meat need extra cheese. Time to make our plates. This is a little mixture that I make for my daughter. Ketchup and just a little bit of A1. I like Goldilocks. Dinner is served! In the hubby plate. Uh huh. Should eat nothing but meat. <laughs> I thought the little plate would be good enough. All right, vegan teacher. 
I'm getting it neat now. I mean, it hurt. Not not a single animal was harmed in the making of this video. Not a single one. I just destroyed some steak. I destroyed it in a good way, though. Yep. In real.